Hi everyone, welcome. Uh, this right here, it's an AMD Radeon Sky 500. And you have probably never heard of it. And whatever good reason, this GPU is originally a workstation GPU. It was meant for servers and really heavy workstations. It was released on 2013 um, and the main reason I wanted to kind of make a video of this is uh, because well no one has ever been bothered to test it out recently a recent time like just literally there's no videos about this and oh, I just wanted to uh, take it for a spin and see how it performs um, uh, performance wise, a um, little bit of specs. This the GPU is clocked at 950 megahertz. The memory is 4 gigabytes of GDDR5, clocked at uh, 1200 megahertz. And you can compare it to a GPU X1050, um, I guess a uh, 1050 nerf. Uh, I'll say like um, maybe a 750 Ti on steroids, <laughs> uh, but not going to the but going close to a 1050. Um, and well, yeah, I'll show you guys the benchmarks and be right back.
you can see um, the games run pretty good with this one um, um, and something I didn't mention before is the little fan here so these cards are passively cooled uh, it only has the heat sink here and it has a vapor chamber underneath uh, the problem is, is that you can't install aftermarket coolers well I mean you can but it's gonna be way more expensive than the card is actually worth and um, it's not an easy task because you have like to cool a lot of stuff because when well, you think that okay this heat sink just should come out and then like this metal shroud just stay but now like this whole thing is one single piece like all these screws are holding everything together like there's no two pieces like it's an entire piece so like calling this graphic card is like it's kind of hard if you want to try to do something um the solution i came up with and if you saw on the benchmarks that i got kind of good temperatures is is attaching a 5 volt um, fan uh, laptop fan uh, so it's just constantly flowing air to the passive cooling Making, making it basically um, one slot um, <laughs> blower style graphics card. <laughs> um, so yeah, um, I just grabbed this 5 volt fan, power it via USB with an adapter, um, so I don't have to cut these wires, I'm just plugging the adapter, plug it to the USB and fan turns on at full speed um, that's why I, I choose a 5 volt because USB only carries 5 volts if you want 12 volt fan you need a special adapter to get to 12 volts to the fan because otherwise it's gonna run at 50% uh, speed it's not gonna run um, at full speed this one will be at 5 volts at full speed and it's actually not that loud like it's it's really quiet, it's not that quiet, but it's not like super super noisy. And well, I, think I guess that's all. See you in the next one.